All right, so we had the covers here. Oh, Ben Affleck, great. Okay, that's good. Okay. Uh, oh, Channing Tatum, fantastic. Oh, here's the one every single person <laughs> is gonna buy. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Channing. I'm so sorry, Ben. It's great that we put you on the cover, but here is what's gonna happen. Every single newsstand. Boom! Bye bye. What, what's back here? Uh, sorry. Oh, uh, what's back there? <laughs> Do you get no slam on them? Just saying. Kind of. Kind of a bummer. They're like, hey, we're, we're giving you the cover of GQ. Awesome. So psyched. Love GQ. So excited to be a cover man. Here's the thing. Same issue cover. Rihanna, totally nude. Okay, well, f you then. Why'd you do that? Why couldn't you have done it when it was just me and, you know, John Hamm or something? Clint Eastwood. I'm going up against naked Rihanna. There's no comparison. Yeah. Now, do you get why she is the obsession of the year? Rihanna kills it. Of course. She's, she's fantastic. Just, I mean, God, man, she's, I feel like the, the her, her last big song just came out. And now you turn on the ring, it's like, there's this thing about diamonds on already. It's like, Rihanna, give us a second to digest the hit. There's a new hit already. You gotta be prolific, I guess, nowadays. Well, she's coming tonight, so maybe you could give her a career advice. She doesn't want to be oversaturated. All right. No, no, she does it just enough. She knows what she's doing. No, she doesn't need my career advice. <laughs> if anything, I need her career advice. Oh, I doubt that, because you were also featured in the issue tonight. Yes, I, that's what I heard. How does it feel to have GQ recognize both you and, and the show? You know, GQ's always been so nice to me and Parks. I always appreciate their support. And uh, it's, it's one of my favorite magazines, so I'm, I'm glad they're on our, on our side. <laughs>